Want caffeine without drinking coffee? Want to get energized with ice cream? Coffee ice cream isn't all created equal, so we're breaking down these popular brands from the worst to the cream of the crop. In 2015, Breyers pledged to use only high-quality ingredients. That specifically means that their ice cream contains 100% grade A milk and cream, meaning that it only uses dairy from cows that aren't treated with hormones. This made us want to love this one, but sadly, we didn't. The second ingredient on the Breyers carton is corn syrup, and you can taste that artificiality in every bite. This is weakened by additives, including vegetable gums and mono and diglycerides, which reveal themselves in the foamy mouthfeel. In terms of the actual coffee flavor, Breyers uses coffee extract, leading to a very mild coffee taste that doesn't come close to achieving the strength and addictive bitterness of the real thing. Our best description of this dessert is artificial milk with a side of weak coffee. Edie's, evidently it's not your normal ice cream. According to the packaging, Edie's coffee ice cream is made with no artificial colors or flavors. Like Breyers, Edie's uses milk and cream that comes from cows not treated with hormones. Unfortunately, this is where the positives about this brand mostly end. The coffee aroma of Edie's is mild at best, and the coffee flavor is almost undetectable. For us, this likens Edie's coffee ice cream to a milk-forward latte, as each bite is excessively milky. The best aspect of Edie's is the creaminess, which is thicker than Breyers but still too liquidy for our liking. The first listed ingredient in Edie's coffee ice cream is skim milk, which makes sense given the overpowering milk flavor of the ice cream that completely lacks richness. Corn syrup is the fourth ingredient, too ahead of coffee, which is evidenced in the absence of depth in the coffee flavor. Turkey Hill's Colombian coffee ice cream is where things start to look promising. This ice cream is made with roasted Colombian coffee beans. Although coffee appears after milk, cream, sugar, corn syrup, whey, and nonfat milk on the carton's list of ingredients, all the dairy for Turkey Hill's ice creams is sourced from local cows within 75 miles of their producer in Conestoga, Pennsylvania. Turkey Hill's Colombian coffee ice cream is smooth and has a gentle but pleasing coffee aroma, the strongest coffee scent so far. Taste and texture are where things go downhill. Turkey Hill is overly runny, like a cappuccino with too much milk. Similarly, the coffee taste doesn't fully come across. We hoped for an amped-up creaminess and stronger coffee flavor that never arrived. In case you haven't heard, non-dairy milks are taking the world by storm. Though almond milk used to have a firm hold in the alternative milk space, oat milk is quickly becoming the milk substitute of choice for consumers who are foregoing dairy. From a texture perspective, Oatly's coffee frozen dessert has the same creaminess and richness as its milk, which gives this coffee ice cream a very pleasing mouthfeel. The coffee flavor could be stronger, as the oat milk taste slightly overpowers the bold intensity we were looking for. On the plus side, Oatly's coffee frozen dessert is organic, fair trade, vegan, certified non-GMO, and glyphosate residue free, reducing your potential exposure to carcinogens. Overall, the coffee flavor could have been more prominent, but if you're looking for a non-dairy ice cream alternative, give this one a try. Blue Marble's Rise Nitro Cold Brew Coffee is the first coffee ice cream thus far that is made exclusively with a particular coffee roaster. Rise Brewing Co. cold brews its coffee beans with nitrogen to enhance the coffee's taste and texture. The coffee beans are from Peru's Cachimayo Valley and are organic and single origin. Blue Marble is a B Corp certified organization based in Brooklyn that is women-owned, non-GMO, and USDA organic. All of its ice creams are made with ingredients that are sourced from fair trade purveyors and organic farms. Blue Marble's Rise Nitro Cold Brew Coffee Ice Cream has a much stronger coffee flavor than all of its predecessors, with a pleasantly tangy intensity that makes this ice cream refreshingly coffee-forward. When we move on to the texture, Blue Marble is somewhat less successful, as it lacks true creaminess and has a slightly unpleasant icy finish. We'd compare Blue Marble's Rise Nitro Cold Brew Coffee to a mildly overwatered Americano. The coffee taste is there, but the richness is absent. Aunt Jenny, what did you get me for my birthday? Creamier Tillamook ice cream. Tillamook is a farmer-owned company that established a health and sustainability initiative called Dairy Done Right, with the promise to remove artificial flavors, sweeteners, colors, and hormones from their products. Tillamook is committed to using no high-fructose corn syrup, which helps them achieve a richer, more authentic flavor in their ice cream. Tillamook's ice cream base is the best so far on this list, with a deeply satisfying creaminess and rich mouthfeel, thanks to the first ingredient on the carton, cream, and the inclusion of egg yolks. Almond shavings are generously distributed throughout this ice cream, enhancing the texture and creating a nice chewiness. 
The chocolate fudge is less evenly woven through, so some bites have a chocolate intensity, whereas others taste mostly of almond. On the negative side, the coffee flavor is somewhat weak in Tillamook's coffee almond fudge, paling in comparison to the chocolate and the almond. Haagen-Dazs is one of Ina Garten's favorite ice cream brands, and we have deep respect for her palate. Haagen-Dazs coffee ice cream is refreshingly made with simple, straightforward ingredients – cream, skim milk, cane sugar, egg yolks, and Brazilian coffee beans – in that order. Haagen-Dazs coffee ice cream is extremely rich and creamy, with a nice coffee aroma that is just strong enough to stay with each and every bite. The coffee flavor is similarly pleasing, but on the milder side. Overall, the ice cream's sweetness overpowers the boldness we generally look for in our coffee. Simply said, Haagen-Dazs coffee ice cream tastes like a cup of coffee made for a kid, as it's loaded up with lots of cream and sugar. Talenti is a gourmet gelato and sorbet brand that was originally only available in select markets, but now you can find it across the U.S. All of Talenti's products use non-GMO sourced ingredients, are free of high fructose corn syrup, added hormones and antibiotics, and are OUD certified kosher. But more importantly, the flavor. Talenti's coffee chocolate chip gelato prominently features chocolate in conjunction with coffee, making this selection desirable for fans of mochas. Spread throughout Talenti's coffee chocolate chip gelato is a generous a smattering of dark chocolate shavings that brilliantly bring out the rich coffee taste. A strong coffee aroma amps up the flavor profile of this dessert, but for hardcore coffee fans, the ratio of coffee to chocolate may be weighed too heavily in favor of chocolate. Hi, I'm Ben. I'm Jerry. Speaking of chocolate, Ben & Jerry's Coffee Coffee Buzz 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 is a coffee flavor loaded with giant chunks of espresso chocolate fudge. The star of the show is undoubtedly the espresso fudge, which embodies the perfect marriage of chocolate and coffee. Smaller chocolate chips have ground espresso beans in them, enhancing the rich flavor pairing. The ice cream itself is just sweet enough without being overpowering, and there's a smooth, satisfying texture to the base. This ice cream is non-GMO and uses cage-free eggs, fair trade coffee, responsibly sourced packaging, and caring dairy, ethically supporting cows and farmers. Coffee Coffee Buzz 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 is another supreme coffee ice cream choice for lovers of mochas and mocha frappuccinos. All of McConnell's ice cream is made with fresh dairy and cream from free-range cows, local eggs from organically fed cage-free hens, pure cane sugar, and zero stabilizers, fillers, or preservatives. One of the first things you'll notice when you dig into McConnell's coffee ice cream are the dense speckles of ground coffee beans. This gives the coffee ice cream a texture similar to Turkish coffee, which is immensely satisfying and pairs wonderfully with the rich creaminess of the ice cream base. While the coffee aroma could be stronger, the taste is exceptionally pronounced, delivering bitter, tart, tangy coffee decadence in every bite. One voluptuous bite can stop you in your tracks. Jenny's was founded in 2002 by Jenny Britton, a James Beard award-winning ice cream maker. Over 20 years later, Jenny's is a household name and a certified B Corp thanks to increased distribution in grocery stores around the country. Not to mention the ice cream's undeniable excellence. All of Jenny's ice creams use direct trade ingredients and are free of artificial flavorings and additives. Jenny's coffee with cream and sugar achieves its rich and sweetly creamy coffee flavor with Intelligentsia Black Cat Espresso, Madagascar Bourbon Vanilla Extract, and cane sugar. Throughout the ice cream, you can see and taste speckles of ground Intelligentsia Black Cat Espresso beans, which add a subtle texture that isn't as prominent as the ground coffee beans in McConnell's. Nevertheless, it contributes powerfully to the strong coffee flavor and aroma. While sugar is in the name of this ice cream, Jenny's coffee with cream and sugar isn't overly sweet. Instead, it masters its name's promise, providing ice cream that is truly equal parts coffee, cream, and sugar. An affogato is an Italian dessert that features one shot of espresso over a thick scoop of ice cream. Van Leeuwen's limited edition ice cream flavor, VL Big Face Coffee Affogato, replicates the pleasure of digging into a hearty bowl of ice cream with espresso poured over it almost perfectly. The coffee flavor is bold and surprisingly reminiscent of salted caramel. The ice cream base has a rich density and a pleasing smoothness, which more than earns it a top five spot. Van Leeuwen's coffee ice cream is made exclusively with a particular coffee roaster, in this case, Big Face Coffee, which was founded by NBA star Jimmy Butler. This ice cream flavor is a limited edition, so be sure to get your hands on a pint before they're all gone. If you're surprised to see Trader Joe's ice cream so high on this list, you're not alone. We weren't expecting to respond so passionately to Trader Joe's Coffee Bean Blast ice cream, but it's one of the best options we tried. There's very little overrun in this ice cream, which means it's creamier than ice creams that have more air whipped into them. Perhaps even more importantly, Trader Joe's Coffee Bean Blast ice cream has the strongest coffee taste 
aroma, and overall flavor profile so far. Trader Joe's brews Colombian coffee and finely ground French roast coffee beans directly into their ice cream base, pairing delicious creaminess with the satisfying nuanced texture of the ground coffee beans. Any true coffee lover will find themselves drawn to Coffee Bean Blast ice cream's bold and mildly bitter flavor that's well-balanced by cream and sugared egg yolks. Trader Joe's Coffee Bean Blast delivers a flavorful cup of Colombian coffee in a single scoop of ice cream. Grater's Vienna Coffee is a masterful homage to a particular coffee specialty. Vienna Coffee is a caffeinated delicacy that marries coffee, whipped cream, and espresso. The blend of roasted Sumatran and Colombian Arabica coffee beans comes across powerfully, providing a nuanced coffee taste while also achieving a remarkably creamy consistency. Grater's has been a family-owned company since 1870. The operation started in Cincinnati, Ohio, where they served homemade ice cream from a cart. It's since developed into an ice cream powerhouse with distribution across most of the U.S. Graders pays homage to its storied history by still making their ice cream the same way it did back in 1870, in small batch French pots. This commitment to quality and handcrafted decadence is evidenced in its ice cream's incredible smoothness. Graders Vienna coffee tastes to us like the perfect coffee-forward latte, magically transformed into a bowl of ice cream. Our favorite coffee ice cream comes from a small creamery in the Adirondack region of New York. Adirondack Creamery was the dream of its founder, Paul N. Nasrini, who spent his childhood churning freshly made ice cream in Pennsylvania. Adirondack Creamery produces unbelievably fresh, rich, and creamy ice cream in upstate New York, containing dairy and eggs sourced directly from local family farms. All of its ice creams are kosher certified, made with milk and cream free of any artificial growth hormones, and free of stabilizers, emulsifiers, artificial colorings, and ingredients. Beyond its all-natural locally sourced mission, Adirondack Creamery's High Peak Perk is our winner because of its exceptional taste, aroma, and texture. The consistency of this coffee ice cream is smooth and decadent, while also having an exquisite crunch thanks to the freshly ground coffee beans that are generously spread throughout. This technique appears in previous ice creams on this list in an attempt to conjure Turkish coffee. But the texture is truly mastered in High Peak Perk. The aroma of the coffee is immensely powerful, and the sweetness is perfectly balanced. The last ingredient in High Peak Perk is cocoa, which amplifies the rich coffee taste by bringing out its delicate nuance. Coming in at the top spot, Adirondack Creamery's High Peak Perk is something we never knew we needed. Cookies and cream in a coffee ice cream. We'd say that's worthy of number one.